Hello there guys, it's me and Stable Voltage. Welcome back to episode 4 of Civilization 5 as India. We are trying to get ourselves the Bollywood achievement, which means that we need to aim for a cultural victory. We are going to jump straight on into the next turn. We've just sorted some of our happiness issues out there. We are now up to plus 8. Still not fantastic. We also need to get a couple of uh, trade routes going as quickly as possible as well. So we've got that incense connected up. We do have some silk, which we will be working towards very, very shortly. Uh, let's go over here now. And um, yeah, we do have a plantation on that one already. So let's go over here and get these horses connected up. We do have two, two new workers that we got down here that uh, originally belonged to Korea, but were captured by barbarians and we managed to nick them for ourselves. Um and uh, as soon as this one has finished work on the spices, we'll most likely get him up here working on the silk itself. Now then, um, Vods is working his way towards these bananas, which I don't particularly like. So I'm going to go ahead and buy those, because I'd very much like to have those for my, uh, my city here. That'll probably upset him quite a bit. I could not care less. Uh, you guys are going to go ahead and construct a camp just there. So, clearing a forest has created 30 production for Mumbai. That's helping with the water mill. There's only a single turn left for that to complete now. You guys go ahead and build that pasture. And, um, yeah, we still need to think about potentially dealing with uh, Alundi. We might not have to. If we don't have to fight him, we won't. It was originally my plan when I started doing that Arabia game that I spoke about on the first uh, video of this series to play more aggressively. But we might not even have to do it in this one. Let's take one of you out there and actually put you in the food. And then we'll grow in one turn. So that's well worth doing. Um, I think we really should... Oh, we could go for hanging gardens. Get a free garden. There again, getting that in the capital probably makes more sense. Uh, let's go ahead and get walls over here. I think we, getting walls everywhere is going to make the most sense. We'll soon have the walls in uh, Vijayanagar, which is fantastic. Mumbai has now grown, which we expected. We were waiting on that. Um, so, yeah, you're going to continue to work that tile. That is fine then. 15 turns until we get the walls. I'm happy with that. There's some random um, Zulu units around here. We could still declare war on me again. That's certainly something that could happen. Uh, we've also got a few more. Uh, there's at least two more dice that we could connect up. What we also want to do at Mumbai, probably after the walls actually, before I forget about this, is we want to get out a workboat so we can go and connect that fish up right there as well. Um, and we also have those spices there. So we're going to have two lots of spices, so we'll be able to sell another one. So quite glad that I got all of these spare workers, even though they are costing us a little bit more in maintenance money. Surprisingly, we didn't get um, moaned at by um, Casimir for buying that tile which surprises me greatly we need to keep our eye on these ones and make sure that we get the ones that are in range before Korea does uh, we will get the deer the deer is within range one two three one two three we'll get the cattle and the spices those are the tiles that we want the other ones are out of our range so we don't care about them too much and we're still working on that not an awful lot else for us to do at the moment couple of turns and those walls will be finished. We are working on the National College. There's only 12 turns for that to be done. In fact, Delhi's going to grow in one more turn. Uh, looks like Korea have had one of their trade routes plundered. Now, even though it's not our trade route, which is fantastic because we don't have to build one, it still does cause some problems because, first of all, what's going to happen is... Um, we lose the the benefits and bonuses we were getting from that trade route. Even though it wasn't our trade route, we do still get something from it. And secondly, if barbarians plunder a trade route, they actually get an, a, a free unit. So that is a problem. Uh, we have uh, grown in population. That is not a good tile. But there aren't really a lot of good tiles that you can work. So I'd sooner you work a food tile, I think, for the time being. Uh, after the National College is done, we might want to go for the... Oh, the Great Wall would be nice. If we could get the Great Wall, I might take the risk of going for that. Just imagine if we could get that, and then that would really screw up um, anybody trying to attack us. Because it's such a pain. Uh, what do we want to research next? 
Um, we probably want to try and get... Um, there's a lot of things I'd like to get. Let's go and see if we can get currency. There's no point getting iron working. We don't actually have any iron. Uh, we do have some horses, though, actually. So we could go and get stables. Let's go horseback riding into currency. The money situation is not brilliant. But at the same time, we've still got to wait for stuff to be built anyway. Vagina Gar has finished its wall, which is fine. Um... Anything we build here is going to cost us money. So let's go ahead and start working on a caravan then. At least the walls are done now. So I feel a little bit uh, happier about that. Gems from Shaka has ended. Now I don't necessarily want to just run in and attack him. Because we really need some way to do some damage to Alundi. And knowing Shaka he's probably got a lot of units by now as well. Mumbai has grown again. We're going to get a lot of growth in Mumbai, actually. It's a really good city for that. Yep, quite happy for you to be working the spices. We've got a few more tiles up here that we can work as well. Um, there's a few people managing to sort their religion out. You've now finished the spices. We do want to get the roads connected. But I also think it's important that we try and get the silk connected as well. We want to sort our happiness issues out. And then we'll get some of the workers working on roads. That'll also be really useful for getting um, troops from uh, one place to another really quickly. Uh, unit needing orders. You have done that camp. Um, in fact, then, you are actually going to start working on the roads, I think. That will also solve some of our money issues. So borders are still growing. Always nice when that happens. You're going to start work on the silk plantation. No, we don't need open borders with you. Parthenon has been completed by Korea. That's fine. We're not working on that. And you guys have finished that one. We have got some other stuff that I'd like to connect up. But I think getting the roads done now is probably going to be the best thing for us. Nope. Still don't want to give you open borders. I didn't want to give it to you last turn. And I don't want to give it to you this turn. Uh, Mumbai demands copper. Does it really? Vijayanagar has grown. Onto a production only tile. I'd sooner at the very least you'd be on one food, one production. Because at least that way you will still grow a little bit. We could just put you on the pure food. Let's have a look on the next turn. We're down to five turns now. Five turns to get that... Um, have you just changed the tile again? On pure production. 12 turns until growth. 24 turns until growth. Yeah, we can grow in like half the time there. Let's sort of default focus that up for now so it doesn't change that on us again. And let's go on to the next turn. I think this unit down here is just trapped. I don't think he's really planning anything. Mumbai's grown again. We're getting some fantastic uh, growth down here. Unfortunately... We don't have a lot of decent tiles. One, two, three. We will want that cattle, but we're going to get that in 16 turns. It's not really a lot. Um, did I miss out on getting that stone? One, two, three. I did, didn't I? When did he get that? That was one of the tiles. Mudge, I think he must have probably already had that one. So that's fine. Th these ones we definitely do want. We can't really have... Well, we could afford to buy a tile if we really wanted to. We're going to get this one anyway. So buying it seems a little bit silly. Um, yeah, I think we'll just carry on working those tiles for the time being. We'll probably want to get our specialists uh, put in over there. Uh, in fact, once you've finished the wall... Maybe you do want to go on to the Hanging Gardens. It'll take a long time to build... But if we can get the Hanging Gardens here and get the um, the free garden, we can use that as a place to put our great people, which we'll really sort of need. So we'll carry on working on the roads over to Mumbai. Um, oh, I was going to say, where's the option gone to build a road? We will need to get some farms and stuff in as well, so we will, we will start working on that. We've cleared that forest. So that's given us some more production. That's put us onto the Hanging Gardens. Delhi's grown again. Fantastic. Now, what are you working now? We're down to sort of tiles that are not really all that good. 
I would also like to try and get the Oracle. In all honesty, there's a lot of things that I'd like to try and get. Getting Wonders is always very, very hard on high difficulty levels. Uh, certainly around Prince and King, it's a lot easier. We are working on the Great Wall now. There's a chance we'll get it, but it's not guaranteed. We shall continue to build our road over to Delhi. Mainly to solve our money problems, but also to allow us to get units between our three cities more quickly. And there we can see we are starting on the wall. Fantastic. Obviously in Civilization VI, the way Wonders work is a, is a lot different. I'm really, really excited to start playing it. I hope as currency. I hope that I get my hands on the preview copy, but it's unlikely to happen. That still doesn't mean that I don't want it to happen, because I really, really do. Um... We could attempt to... We want to get things like the Artist Guild up and running as soon as possible. Now, is there anything here that we really need straight away? Lighthouse would be useful, but it's not overly important. Um, Parthenon's already been built. So I missed out on that one. We definitely want to get the Writer's Guild, though. So let's, let's queue up Drama and Poetry. We might even end up getting the Writer's Guild in Mumbai. I really don't know yet. We'll have to see how that works out. Kept our expansion promise. Vijayanagar has finished the caravan. Let's go ahead and... We have one source of horses here. So that's not going to be terribly useful. Let's go ahead and get a shrine. Because we're not doing too well in our uh, religion output at the moment. Caravan. What is our best trade route? Um... Trade overview. Trade routes available. And we want highest gold. So Delhi to Zhengzhou. So we want to transfer you to Delhi. And we will want to get another caravan as well at some point. You guys are getting these roads done nice and quick. Which is what we like to see. Unmet player has entered the medieval areas, uh, era. So we've still got a couple of other people to find. Oh, units need orders. I missed that one. So what have we got here? The caravan's arrived already, so you're going to go to Zhengzhou. Give us five gold. On to the next turn. Uh, yep, yeah, declaration of friendship. Let's keep that going as much as we can. Obviously, they're going to want it because, you know, it's Korea. They, they love being able to get their science bonuses. They are very science-focused, which is why they want declarations of friendship with everybody. We'll soon have these roads completed. Looks like um, these Zulu warriors might get spat out shortly. If our border keeps expanding in that direction. Let's have a quick look over here. Now then, his borders are getting very, very close to the spices, which we don't like. So we're going to go ahead and buy that tile so that he can't get them. And you don't have anything you can grab that we care about. Mumbai's grown again. Which I guess is brilliant because you're now working that tile there. We'll soon get that cattle. Making some decent money now, so that's nice. What is dr Drama and poetry has now completed. We will go into civil service so we can get the... the civil service we want or is it guilds? It's guilds we want, I think. Or... Um, no, I thought it was one of these, but it wasn't. We do want to get gardens. I think we're going to go into guilds. You have finished connecting that up. Uh, I'm just going to get you over here to help with the roads briefly. And then you can go over there and work on the plantation. Uh, we'll also want to... Um, right, you've done that road. So you're going to build a road section there. And if you guys build a road section there, then we'll get that done in five turns. And then you can go up and work on the uh, the spices. And then we might have something we can trade away then. Vijayanagar has also grown. Uh, Delhi has also grown as well. Fantastic. Again, you don't really have any particularly brilliant slots to work on, but that is fine. Uh, Vijayanagar, again, you're pretty much just working everything that's available. We are getting some extra culture, though, from, uh, from those plantations, so that is nice. People reforming their religion already. In fact, are there any religions that are still available? Um, there are still two more religions that can be founded. So we might get one still. 
Uh, you guys have just about finished, so once that road is done, Vijayanagar will be connected up to Delhi. And as soon as these two guys have done, so will Mumbai. Vijayanagar's finished the shrine. Um, happiness is okay for the moment. We should probably get... We could get Petra over here, actually. Gives us some extra culture. We do have a desert tile. It's 41 turns. That's a long... A lot of turns to dedicate to actually building something. Gives us a free caravan as well. I think we've got to give it a go. There's no point playing on these easy, easier difficulties if you can't try fun things. Because these are the things you can't do on the high difficulties. Because the AI will always beat you with all of its crazy bonuses. So on to the next turn. City Connection has been established. Which one? This one. Mumbai is now done. So, workers will need orders. You can go over here and work on a plantation. You guys can go over there and work on a plantation. Colossus has been built in a land far away. Not something that I was planning to build. Now, one thing that we won't be doing is... Um, Chopping down... I never improve bananas because having the jungle tile is just so much better usually. Especially when, once you get um, universities because you get additional science from the jungle. Uh, we need to improve that, so let's go and work on that one. Of course, now we've got roads, we can move around a lot more quickly. Yeah, we don't have a lot of desert tiles, but it'd still be useful. So let's get you guys down there. Can't do anything else on this turn. You guys can switch plantation. Looks like you're trying to spread your faith to me there, Korea. I don't really like that all that much. Korea is already starting to get some um, tourism. So we might need to sort that problem out. Uh, let's get iron working into... Um, probably iron working into machinery. We can go straight into machinery. I think we go iron working then into machinery. We'll do it that way. We could rush Notre Dame. No, I think we'll do it that way. Um, you are building a plantation. Mumbai's grown again. You're working pretty much all of the good tiles you can. 22 turns for the hanging gardens to be completed. So, on to the next turn. Alundi is getting bigger, but I'm not terribly concerned. Our borders have now grown to this um, cattle tile, which is useful. Uh, one, two, three. I mean, we, our borders might still naturally extend as far as these dies. We won't be able to work the tile, but we'll still be able to connect the dies up and uh, trade it away. Uh, Poland would like dies. Oh, we've actually completed the Great Wall. I'm surprised by that. I'm happy about it, but I'm surprised by it. Um... Do we want to get either of these? Getting a free policy would be really, really nice. Let's go and try for the Oracle as well. That is one of the ones that the AI does like to try and get, though. So we're not guaranteed that we'll be able to get it. We can adopt a new policy. Now, what we probably want to do is go for um, aesthetics. Because we want to be able to generate extra culture. So we start off by opening that, which gets us our great artists, writers, and musicians 25% faster and allows us to build the Uffizi. I don't think the Uffizi has been built yet. Um, let's just have a quick look. What do you need to unlock to build the um, Uffizi? I can't even remember where it is. I'm always terrible at finding stuff on this uh, this list uh, where are we it'd probably be a lot easier if I just went and checked the um, civilopedia because that's what it's there for if it's see oh no I if it's see there we go uh, it's unlocked with architecture Gives us plus two culture and gives us a free great artist. So architecture is... Um, have you already got architecture? I, I'm so terrible at remembering the, um, the tech tree in this game. Where are we? Architecture is like well below this, isn't it? I 
am not even seeing it right now. I'm just having a brain fart, apparently. Astronomy, acoustics, no. Architecture, there it is. So it's quite quite a ways up the tree. Um, but after machinery, we probably do want to go into education. So we'll queue that up anyway. It gives us the option to do it later. That's the important thing. So we'll try and squeeze one or two more turns in. Dies to Bismarck ended. We'd very much like to get that um, deal going again if you'd be willing to. And you are, so that's great. Clearing of Forest has given us some more production, which is actually nice because that helps with the uh, construction of Petra. And having a lot of wonders will help us with tourism. I mean, that's that's this is the thing. In, if you want to get a tourism victory in Civilization V, you really have to wonder spam. And it's pretty much impossible to wonder spam on high difficulties because the AI will always beat you simply because it has tech advantages and it has production advantages. Yeah, look, we've got um, we've got Korea over here spreading their religion to us, which is a little bit unfortunate. Um, we might still be able to uh, to push that out, but I'm not sure if the, if it's going to work. It's very annoying. We may have to go and deal with the Koreans at some point. Um, obviously we have spare dyes. You want to now swap it for um, cocoa, so we'll do that. It'll give us even more happiness. Yeah, so we got those spare dyes there. We've we can also go now. Oh, little bit of a glitch there. Obviously something to do with the Great Wall. When I right-click on it, that happens. It's a bit strange. Uh, Mumbai has grown again. Although it's up to 10 citizens. Does this city keep going into starvation? I'm sure that the, the number keeps going up and down. Although we are we are working quite a lot of tiles, so maybe I'm imagining that. It's on 10, 10 people at the moment. I haven't seen any reports saying a city's starving, so... It does have quite a lot of food, though. It is doing quite well. It's going to have even more once we get those uh, fishing boats out. So we will do just one final turn and then I really do have to consider ending this video. So you guys are going to start working on that plantation and that is all we can do. So we'll be ending the video there. Thanks a lot for watching guys. I hope you are still enjoying Civilization 5. I'll see you on the next video and until then, goodbye for now.